Queen Victoria had a bunch of children. One of them was King Edward VII. And he had George V, who had George VI, who won an Oscar, um, who had Elizabeth and Charles. Queen Victoria's second eldest son was Prince Alfred of Saxe-Coburg, which was the family name Saxe-Coburg. And Prince Alfred married the daughter of the Tsar of Russia. So Tsar Alexander II has a daughter, Maria. Queen Victoria has a second eldest son, Alfred. They marry. And they have my great-grandmother called Victoria Melita of Great Britain because her father was Alfred of Great Britain and her grandmother was Queen Victoria. She then goes and marries her first cousin, Grand Duke Kirill of Russia. So Grand Duke Kirill of Russia and Victoria Melita of Great Britain, granddaughter of Queen Victoria, they have children and one of them is my grandmother. So she is the, her title is Grand Duchess Maria of Russia. So my grandmother, Grand Duchess Maria of Russia, married my grandfather, the Prince of Leiningen, which is a principality in Germany. So you only get your father's title. So even though it's Great Britain and Russia and then a whole bunch of other families, my father happened to be the Prince of Leiningen, so my title is His Serene Highness Prince Hermann Friedrich of Leiningen. And there is still a palace of Leiningen where my first cousin lives, Andreas, who's married to a Hanover, so the Hanover royal family married the Leiningens, next generation kept it going. And there's also a big castle, and it's called Schloss Leiningen, the castle of Leiningen. It's actually in a place called Wald Leiningen, the forest of Leiningen. So it's Wald Schloss Leiningen. It wasn't really till I, probably my teens, that I, it clicked, you know, that Uncle Beppo was the last king of Italy, the son of Victor Emmanuel of Italy. And my grandmother Giovanna was the queen of Bulgaria, but formerly the princess of Italy. So it, it just, at one point you put it together and you become interested.